happy Sunday afternoon, everybody. Welcome to another edition of Bridget's Chalk and Boutique. It is Sunday afternoon. We are just chilling down in the craft room. So let me tell you guys what we're gonna be doing. I'm doing this live. So this, um, today, I have two projects, but I think we might just do one. So I got these. Hey, Donna. Um, if you guys remember last weekend, I painted these. Remember when I did the spell books, which turned out amazing, by the way. Um, I painted these. I got them from um, the Dollar Tree. I painted them, and we're going to do something super cool with them today. Oh, you're going to love this, Donna. Seriously, it's so cool. Did you see the spell books? So if you guys are watching, the, if you see the red box, that means I'm live. So make sure you say hello. If the red box above my head is not there, that means that I am, this is the replay. So I put hashtag replay. So I know that you saw it. Hey, Sue Ellen, thanks for tuning in. Did y'all see when we painted these? It was the day that we finished up the spell books. Remember, these turned out so cool. Notice this pattern. Oh, you saw the beginning. So this is, this is how they look when I finished them. They're so cool. So this one is the second one that I made. Um, but I'm trying to show you guys some different uses for this one particular one. But look at, didn't that turn out awesome? <laughs> like, yes, I'm gonna start selling these. <laughs> like, they're so cool to make and I did the water on the pages and like, they're awesome. And so I wanted to show you this pattern has been super popular for Halloween. So this is the damask, the skull damask. And so we're gonna use that today with the one, um, with these skulls that I got from the Dollar Tree. So I'm excited. I'm like, so I wanna show you, cause so, I'm telling you, Dollar Tree has like your, like add-on stuff. So I got this ribbon at the Dollar Tree with the sugar skulls. Isn't that cool? So I was like, this is gonna go really good. Let me sprinkle this and then we will get started. This one I don't think should take too long. Um, I have another project that maybe we'll do after. But so what I did was I just got these, they're just wood cutouts. The Dollar Tree has a lot of wood cutouts for, um, I wonder if I can like, somehow share this. Hi, hold on, sorry guys. Um, they have wood cutouts for like every season. How much for the books? I'm gonna sell them for 20 each. So, and plus shipping. Cause these are detailed. <laughs> like, they, um, they were labor intensive. It took me about three days to make them and I am gonna make some more. So if you want one of these, let me know. Um, I do plan on making some more. So um, I don't know how much shipping would be, but I can tell you. Okay, let's see. Post. Let me um, sprinkle this. Oh, my reception's looking pretty good today. <laughs> like, so, oh, one other thing while we're flipping this. So I, um, the happy customer group. Okay. Wanted to let you guys know that, do you want one, Donna? Awesome, well shoot me a message. Let me know which one you want. The, there's the spell book right here that has the, um, the skeleton on the front and it says spells and then on the side on the back we've got this pattern that you're gonna see yeah a message um, I'll message you and get all your info but just I just want you to see so that's the skeleton and this is the witchy looking one okay so those are the two that I have so we'll chat later yay <laughs> guess I got one left <laughs> all right so let's do this I just sprinkled um, and let's um let's do these okay they're gonna be so cool so all right so what i did was i just painted these with acrylic paint that was it you can't well you can't really see the black one when i'm holding it because so i just painted both sides so this is our black sugar skull that we're gonna work with and this one is our magenta so um what i'm gonna do is and you could actually go buy like a bunch of these and make like a garland um at the dollar tree they have um, Christmas cutouts too. Wait till y'all see the patterns we're gonna do for Christmas. Okay, let's do them. So we're gonna take, this is our, this one is super cool. This pattern right here is our skull damask. And it's like a staple for Halloween, right? Like you kind of have to have this for Halloween. So we're gonna just put this right over top. Now, I'm not 
quite sure how I want to do this. So I thought about like doing different colors. I don't know. Can you guys see what I'm doing? I want to make sure that... Oh, what I was going to tell you guys is... So there's an internet company that says they can fix... You guys know how I get like horrible internet and like my stuff cuts out and gets fuzzy. So they're coming on Tuesday and they swear they can fix it. So fingers crossed, guys. If my internet gets fixed, y'all are going to be sick of me. I'll <laughs> be on here all the time. So I'm just putting this pattern right on top, okay? And you can, there's no right or wrong way to do it. We just have to figure out like, I think I wanna move it over a little. What colors we wanna do? We can do it all one color, just to keep it simple. This is a just a really cool, you can use this as a background too. Like if you were doing like a Halloween um, picture or something. You could take this and put it as a background and have it just a shade or two brighter than what your background is. Like, so if you were doing it on white, you could do maybe like a cream color and then do your Halloween picture. So it would be like, yeah, really, really cool. All right, so we got it pretty good. I'm making sure the skulls are kind of where I want them because there's like holes in my thing. You know what I mean? So let's pick out some colors to do. So I have some colors already um, made up that we can do and you can do whatever color you want I mean we could just do it simple and like just do it all white which I think would look cool too but I kind of want to make it pop so what I did was I I took my ribbon and I pulled the colors from the ribbon so like this is orange obviously for Halloween and then I pulled our bumblebee which is like a super bright yellow and then um the raspberry sorbet I think would be pretty cool with it and then I have this we don't even have this anymore it's grape soda I'm almost out I don't know if I'm gonna use it but I have it so let's do maybe with the magenta colored one let's do like I mean we definitely can't do raspberry sorbet because that's not we'll do that on the black one let's do let's do a little orange and yellow how about that and see what it looks like. Hey guys, thanks for tuning in. Make sure you guys say hello so I know who's here. If you're new, it's your first time watching me, welcome. Just say, I'm new, so I can say hi. Because I don't know who's here unless y'all tell me. So we can, let's just go for it. I don't know if I wanna do like a certain line. I don't know, I've never done it like this. <laughs> let's just see, see what it looks like. I, don't, I think I kind of like the orange, just orange. I might just do the whole thing orange because it's going to be pumpkin-y. This is going to be cool, guys. Or you could totally just do it white. Let's do this strip. See how it's like lines, which is cool. So you can kind of figure out what you want to do with it. And I'm just taking my squeegee, if you've never seen me do this, and I'm putting them... Um, pushing the paste through all right so these are silk screen transfers which are really cool fun to work with and you can use them over and over and over again and so this is um, our skull to mask Halloween pattern and it's awesome okay so I'm just kind of like trying to find a good divide so where I can start a new color like I said there's no right or wrong way we're just gonna play with it if we don't like it, we'll flip it over, <laughs> right? So um, once you do it on this surface, you're kind of stuck. It's kind of permanent. Uh, but if you do it on a chalkboard or a different kind of surface, um, if you don't like the way it looks, you can just erase it and start over, which is cool because I've done that before. That's what I, and the paste is super forgiving. Okay. I think that's cool like that all right so let's do another color let's do yellow hi Amy thanks for tuning in some of you it'll tell me like someone says watching but then like other people it doesn't tell me so I don't know why okay so we want to we don't want this to dry we want to pull it up some because um, what will happen is it will start to stick Oh, that's gonna look cool. Where do you guys see this? You want a little sneak peek? Can you see? How long can you see it? I don't wanna pull it up, but this will give you a little sneak peek. So we're just kinda gonna let it. 
and then I'm going to put it back down and do the next color because you don't want the paste to dry in the silk screen because when you pull it up, if you do that, it will pull up your paste with it. So you, this is why we call it a transfer because we are actually transferring the paste through the silk screen, right? Some people call them stencils. I used to call them stencils. They don't like that. We're not supposed to do that. All right, I got ended up get, making a mess with some of this orange. This is just a, um, a wipe. Don't use baby wipes on your transfers, guys. You can use disinfectant wipes, but don't use baby wipes on them because the oil will ruin the stick. You don't want to do that. All right, let's do some yellow. Ready? Ready? It's going to look cool. I was trying to do this yesterday, and then my husband was like, let's go to Oktoberfest. I'm like, okay. So we went out to Oktoberfest yesterday. They one of the breweries. It was kind of cool. They had like all like German music and brats and it's like really starting to feel like fall. So now I'm like getting in the Halloween mood. And I'm super excited about this internet people coming on Tuesday. <laughs> so like I'm gonna try to get a modem down here because like there's all kinds of cool stuff. Like I, I have the technology to do um, like two cameras at a time so you guys can watch me this way and then also do an overhead. Um, I have the setup for that, but my cellular or my um, internet is so bad it won't do it. So we're hoping that this will fix it and it's gonna be so much better for you guys too because um, you'll be able to see me from different angles, which will be cool. Hey Wanda, thanks for tuning in. Hello, hello. I can see some of you. And then some of you I can't. <laughs> so make sure y'all say hello when you're here. I want to know what y'all are doing for fall. Allison joined us. Hello. Thanks for tuning in. Yeah, it doesn't tell me everybody. So we are just doing, I picked these up, guys. These are wood cutouts that I got from the Dollar Tree, which is cool. So, like, you can get super creative. Hey, Natalie. Um, super creative with these um, wood cutouts and these patterns. So like we used this pattern last weekend. Um, I'll show you guys in a second when we get move on to the next part. But last weekend I used the same pattern to do the spell books that I made. If you guys remember me making the spooky spell books, which turned out amazing by the way. I have them over here. I'll show you. Um, I used this on the back and it looks really cool. And so now this is a different way to do it. So the pattern transfers that we carry are fantastic. And I don't wanna say, talk about the C word too soon because I know we're just in September and we're doing Halloween, but where do y'all see what I do with the Christmas patterns? Just saying. So when you guys are ordering, make sure you get those Christmas patterns because you're gonna want every one of them. All right, so I think the yellow looks pretty good. Let's pull it up and see. Okay, ready, ready, ready? Do, do, do. Do, do, do. And if we mess it up, no big deal. We'll just flip it over and do the back. Can y'all see this? See how it's like. I'll hold it up so you guys can see. Cause I gotta, well no, I can't really. Cause I gotta put this back down. Can y'all see the details on it? So we'll let that dry. If you guys are just tuning in, this is the same pattern that I used for the back of this spell book. Didn't that look awesome? Like we used, what did we use for this? The gold or the copper? It was the shimmer gold or shimmer copper. And that was the same pattern that I used on the spell books that I'm now using on our little um, Halloween cutouts. <laughs> They're super cool. Hey Becky, thanks for tuning in. So another thing that you guys can do with this, if you can find them. Oh, you remember the garland a couple weeks ago I made with this transfer? So again, Dollar Tree had wooden cutouts. Um, and I got, what did we do them on? Um, I think they were ghosts we did them on. Um, I know Dollar Tree's like, they have all kinds of cutouts. But we made that garland. And I used the same pattern to make that garland. Like you said, hello, hello. I love when you guys say hi. <laughs> it's super fun. So this one is, oh, you know what? We should do some black. We should do some black. Hold on. Let's put some black on this one because, yes, we're going to use shimmer shadow. It's going to look cool. Okay. 
I'm having fun with this, if you can't tell. Like, this is like seriously like my addiction to shocking and Dollar Tree and wreaths and making beautiful pictures. And like, this is the shimmer shadow. This is, this is so cool. It shimmers. Shimmer, shimmer. Okay, so, um, yeah, so the garland, the wood cutouts at the Dollar Tree, I made a garland with this, and it turned out really awesome. So, uh, the sky's the limit with these patterns. The patterns are just like, because when you first see them, you're like, what am I going to do with that pattern? You're going to make all kinds of goodness with these patterns, and you can do that with all of our transfers. Like, um, we also have to do more of our club couture. I got to do that, too. I got, um... I was waiting on the mini tags to come in. You guys know what I'm talking about? The little, um, they look like gift tags. Um, I was waiting on those to come in because we're going to do this one. Again, I'm going to show you guys more uses for the September Club Couture. And I have October's on the way, so you guys will be able to see. If you're not a club member, you should check it out because it's really cool. All right, so... Um, we're gonna make a garland with the fall one. I, I have all these projects, so we gotta start chalking. Hey, Nancy, how are you? <laughs> Nancy's here. I love when you guys pop on and hang out with me on Sunday. Sorry about I didn't make it for wine last night. Hey, Max, thanks for tuning in. You, I Sometimes on Saturdays, I can do Saturday night wine with a chance of crafting. And that is exactly what happened last night. I was down here in my craft room prepping this project because I was going to do this last night with you guys. Thanks, Nancy. She sprinkled. Yeah, if you guys sprinkle out a little bit, <laughs> that's S-H-A-R-E. Um, so last night I was going to do this and I was down here and then my husband was like, come on, honey. He's like, let's go to Oktoberfest. And I'm like, and I was already whining and there was no chance of crafting. Oh, sorry, guys. I told you it happens on Saturdays. Saturdays are just like, eh, you never know with me. Um, I'd like to get to where I do them regularly, <laughs> but it was a rough week. <laughs> All right, I'm still doing the shimmer shadow, which I really like. This is, this looks pretty cool. Do do do. And you could like do, like half and half. There's no right or wrong way. I mean, you could totally do this. Um, any way that you want. I'm just making sure that I, that I got it. I think I need a little bit more up here. And you can't tell like which one goes with which. We're gonna do these. And it's gonna come out amazing. Are you guys excited to see it? Yeah, I think we're just gonna do these two because I have, I have another board to do too. <laughs> like I have so many projects. Maybe what we'll do is when we're done with this one, I'll take a little break and then I'll come back in a little while, depending, and we'll do some more projects today because I gotta get them done. Um, all right, all right, let's pull this up and see, and then we'll just have one more side to do. Oh, you got your deer yesterday? That's awesome. Oh, she said, you notice I laughed at your pose. That's funny. Yeah, but deer, oh my God, you guys. Um, gosh, sorry, I shouldn't have said it that way. Um, the deer, the holiday stuff has shipped. My stuff is coming on Tuesday. Yes, home office is catching back up. So if you guys don't know this, I don't know if you guys know this, but we were running three weeks on orders. Um, it was taking three weeks to get stuff. And so I think they're caught up, which is awesome for you guys and for me. So I can order more stuff for you guys and you guys can get your stuff. So we are full-fledged Halloween right now because you guys still have plenty of time to order your Halloween stuff. I guess everybody now is like getting ready for Halloween. I think it's going to be cool. Let's do, should we do white? Why not? We'll just do white on the last side. I think it'll be cool. Yeah, so mine are coming Tuesday. I'm so excited. Wait till you see all the Christmas stuff. We're not just talking about Christmas. We're talking about Halloween. But I'm excited. I'm like, what? what is it, Elf? And he's like, is it Christmas? That's me. I love that little meme. All right, we're going to do the last piece of this white. And, like, you can just do two colors if you want. Or you can do, even just doing it all one color, I think, is going to look pretty awesome. Lisa is watching. Hi, Lisa. Thanks for tuning in. 
I love it when you guys pop on. If you guys have questions about what I'm doing, let me know. Uh, I see a lot of new people too, so um, if it's your first time watching, check this stuff out, it's awesome. I also have a VIP group. Um, some of you may be in, some of you may not be in. You definitely wanna be in my VIP group because I do some cool stuff in there. I do live sales on Thursday nights at eight o'clock where I sell these products. Um, and they come directly from me. So I get a lot of stuff that's been like, I have retired transfers, things that have been, you can't get anymore, hard to find things. So, um, and I have great specials in there too. So make sure you guys check that out. You can put, if you're not in the group or you're not sure, just put hashtag VIP and I'll just give you the link and then you can join. So, um, and all of this stuff you can order right on my chalk site. So if you're, you're watching on my business page, at the top of my page it says shop now, that'll take you to my, my store, where my online store where you can order and they will ship it directly to you. And it looks like we are um, getting orders in a normal fashion. <laughs> like, oh, three weeks was a long time to wait. Like, I, at one point I had like four orders in and they hadn't shipped and then all of a sudden it was like they just caught up, which is awesome. Patches is here. Hi, Patches. Thanks for tuning in. Welcome, welcome. If you're new, I want to know who's new so I can say hi to you guys. I love going live. And hopefully my internet is doing well. Oh, Patches said hi. New to your videos. Awesome. Well, welcome. I hope you, hope you like my videos. They're a lot of fun. And first, I will tell you guys, I do apologize. I live in the country. Like, in the country, and my internet, this looks cool, I got ADD, my internet is horrible. So, um, there's sometimes that I go live, and my live stream is horrible, and it gets fuzzy, and like, there's nothing I can do, but I have a new internet company coming out to my house on Tuesday, and they swear that they can fix it. So, hopefully, it'll be better, because I, mean, I have a lot of followers, and you've got, and I get it, you don't want to watch, like, a bad live stream. Look at that. Doesn't that look cool? I think it looks pretty awesome. It's got a lot going on with this. Like, but you can see the detail. I think I'm going to do the other one just solid. I think the other one I'm just going to do like solid raspberry sorbet. But look at the details in that. Isn't that pretty? Like, you can totally, like, I want to string them together. I'm going to somehow, somehow, when I'm done with my life, I'm going to figure out how to incorporate this ribbon. See the ribbon that I got to go with it? Dollar Tree, guys. Dollar Tree has your ribbon. That's your ribbon headquarters. All right, we got to let this dry. All right, now, if you wanted to do the backside, you could, depending on what you want to do with it. Um, if you want to just hang it on the wall, you don't need to. But if you want to do something... Um, like make a garland or something out of it, I would recommend doing both sides because if it flips around, it, it'll be bare. And <laughs> I jumped on at the right time. I love skulls. I know, it's so cool. Did you see this book that I made? This was, I wanted to see you guys. So this skull pattern is the same pattern that I used for this, right? And then I did oh, <laughs> the spells on the side, which I think turned out really cool. All right, so this is the same pattern. And then I also made a Halloween garland, which is over there. Um, I think, yeah, I don't have it. I need to put it up behind me. And I used that to make the skulls too. So it looked really awesome. So if you like skulls, you definitely need this one because a, a lot of times we get them. We got one from last year. Whew. And I haven't demoed it because you guys can't buy it because it's gone and I can't get it. So I'm not going to show it to you. <laughs> but I made this pillow. It was a skull. They put new stuff out. Like, we get new stuff every couple months. We have new products coming in. So we had this skull last year. And it was like, um, how do you describe it? Some of y'all saw it last year. It was like a pair. It reminded me of, like, the catacombs. You know, like, the Paris type. Oops, I'm going to get orange on that. Um, the Paris type theme. You know what I mean? Like... I don't know how to explain it. Patches, if you like that one, shoot me a message and I'll send you a picture of it because I have it in my book. I can just show you what I'm talking about. It was cool. Um, just because you said you like skulls. <laughs> like, it was cool. So you, you should be checking out our chalk stuff because 
I mean, we come out with some crazy amazing things. I'm just trying to find a clean spot to put this so I don't have to go wash this transfer. I might have to. Yeah, because it's not going to fit. Um, she said, oh my God, you have a skull transfer. I'm just starting out. Yes, it's, um, it's pretty cool. We have some really cool stuff. All right, I'm trying to find a good spot to put this because see the yellow is gonna get on it. Oh, we might just have to do like this way. Okay. Hey Chris, I'm just trying to put this in the, it's starting to stick, I think I got it. We might just have one side that we'll have to like put something on. Oh, you just joined? That's awesome. Well, congratulations. Hey, Scott, thanks for tuning in. Did you join, oh, you are you a designer or did you um, join Club Couture? Because it's super cool. Scott's tuned in. Yeah, like, if you like crafting, this is the way to go. <laughs> like, this stuff is like, it's my drug. <laughs> Let's see. Oh, let's see. Carrie's watching. Tina's here. Hey, girl. Where did you get your skull boards? Tina, I knew Tina would pop on. She's like, she likes Halloween and stuff. Um, oh, the skull board. These were from the Dollar Tree. I got them at the Dollar Tree, and um, I painted them. I just painted them with acrylic paint, and now I'm taking and putting this one on top of it. Um, and so this is like a super popular pattern. Tina probably likes this one too. <laughs> oh, you joined the Club Couture. Yeah, Club Couture is awesome. Awesome, awesome, awesome. So um, Club Couture is our monthly subscription program. If you guys don't know about it, it's like the best kept secret. <laughs> like you should be a club member because you get, um, I'm gonna do this whole one this color, but you get um, a transfer every single month sent to you in the mail. It's $20 a month. And you get individual paste packets, which is awesome. Um, and then you also get um, flat rate shipping. Well, we have flat rate shipping anyway of $6.95. But club members get it for $4.95, whatever you want. Order as much as you want. Um, and then they have different sales, which is really cool. So, um, like this month, our club members get 50% off previous club transfers. So the thing with the club transfers is you cannot buy them unless you're a club member. So once the month is over, that transfer goes away. It's never offered for sale to the general public. And so we have some really awesome transfers. I'll show you this month in just a second. Um, but this month's transfer is, I've already used it once and I'm going to make some more stuff with it to show you. But the way the transfers are made, you're going to get all kinds of different, um, you get different uses for them. And so I try to show my people like how you can use your different, your transfer different ways every month, right? Because like our, tra our transfers are reusable. So um, like you can wash them and reuse them over and over again. And so you get the, the club transfers, specifically they design them. Um, to have lots of uses like last month we did the rise up and I think I used it like four or five different ways it was really cool yeah check your Dollar Tree for the wood cutouts this is this month's club transfer which I just did it on a board isn't that beautiful fall blessings and so I've got more stuff we're gonna do with this one right here oh, we're gonna actually make some garland with this that's this month's club so if you guys are not a club member, you can still get in on the club and you can still get this one. Um, if you look at the top of my business page where it says shop now, just click on that. It'll take you to my site and you can sign up for Club Couture. Um, and when you sign up, they, um, they'll give you the option to buy this month's. So I would recommend doing that. And my personally enrolled club members, if you signed up under me and you are in my VIP group, you get um, specials in there also. Um, I offer special things and stuff for my club members in addition to what you get for from home office. So it's 
If you like this kind of stuff, it's a great way to see the products, to use them, get them in your hand, start building your transfer collection, and then if you find that you're just like totally addicted, you can become a designer like me and you can save 40%. Just saying. I save 40% on everything that I buy. So um, if you want more information about that, let me know. I have a VI, I have a group on here, an income group for my business page that I talk all about the business side of things. So keep that in mind. Because a lot of people don't realize, like, you guys see us shocking. Um, I spoke to a lady today who, I live in Virginia, and she was in Kansas City. And so she's seen this before, but she never knew that, like, she like how to sell it or how to get into it or anything and so um, I talked to her on the phone told her all about it and so she's gonna sign up she's super excited so I know sometimes it's like you see this stuff and you're like I don't know raspberry sorbet yes <laughs> oh what color is that you're using I love yeah it is raspberry sorbet good job Nancy Nancy's on it yeah sometimes I don't see the comment when I'm when I'm pasted, but I will answer them. If I miss it, if you guys ever say something, I miss it. I always check. I'll go back and look. So, or Nancy. Nancy helps out. <laughs> she does a good job. <laughs> Nancy makes some cool stuff, too. Like, we just are one big, happy, shocking family. But Club Couture is the way to go. I'm telling you, I love it. And as a designer... I get your club transfer every month too, which is cool. So then I can show you guys how to use it. So I love my club members. They are awesome. They get um, discounts too. Like they've done like transfer discounts and surface sales and chalk sales. And like it, it really does pay to be a club member. I promise. All right. So I'm going to go back over here and get this on the yellow. She said, I never thought to use that for Halloween. Yep. <laughs> yes, that's why you got to watch us when we do these. We'll give you so many ideas. Like I, like, I just like this color anyway. I like bright colors. And I have a thing for sugar skulls because of... Do you guys, you guys don't know who my favorite band is. And my favorite band is Zach Brown Band. I'll have to show you something that I made while this is drying. I can handle the easy question. I appreciate it, Nancy. This looks amazing. Okay. And this is why you want to buy transfers when you see them because once this retires, we won't have it anymore. And so you're going to want them in your collection. So this is our finished sugar skull with just the raspberry sorbet. Give it some hearts if you like it. Doesn't it turn out awesome? So this is just one solid color. And you saw how easy it was to do. And so this one is still drying, and I just played around with this one. I think I like this one better. <laughs> hey, Samantha. So here's this one, and then here's this one. So you can get different looks with it. If you really, really wanted to take your time with it, you could do each one like a different color and get really detailed, like crazy detailed. Like see how the sugar skull is on here? You could literally do that with this transfer. Just take your time. Um, those are It's time consuming, but it's gorgeous when it's done. So just for the Sugar Skull fans, I will show you something. Um, and we don't have this transfer anymore. That's why I don't like to show you, but I'll, if you like Sugar Skulls, I want to show you something that I did um, right when I first started. So like almost two years ago, we had this transfer and I made this. <laughs> That's our sugar skull transfer that we used to have. So, and this is my favorite band in the whole wide world. I'm completely obsessed with them. So I can't sell this as like, you know, band merchandise or anything. This is just for my personal. I put it, it's hanging on my wall. Isn't that gorgeous? So it was like five layers. It was actually one of the first transfers that I did. And I just did it on a black canvas. And now I'm wishing I would have done it on something else. I still have the transfer in my pack. Um, because I keep them and I mean I can do this stuff for myself but I can't I'm, I'm obsessed with that brown man but I don't sell it you know it's like a copyright thing so anyway that was my sugar skull but don't y'all love it ah, so well thank you <laughs> yeah it was time consuming it was um, I've done a couple of them and I actually had extra ones but I sold them so uh, it's really important that you guys like 
pay attention to transfers because they come in and they go. And so, um, same thing with our club transfers. Like, usually you don't have a chance to, to get them again. So, um, so this one has been super popular. This is our, um, our fall blessings. And so I'm going to show you guys, we're going to make a garland with the letters. And we're going to make a fall garland. And I'm a big Dollar Tree person, you guys. You can get crazy good stuff at the Dollar Tree um, to accessorize with your chalk couture. So um, make sure you guys keep an eye out for what I'm doing. I'll give you guys some really good ideas on things that you can do. Um, and I love, but, and I will tell you, obsessed is putting it mildly I know can I tell you guys something so um so I'm obsessed with Zach Brown band I don't even have a crush on him Keith Urban is my free pass my husband knows that um I just respect Zach and the, the guys as musicians because they I'm a musician I play the guitar uh, they are so talented and so um I was at a concert and I have a big tattoo on my back with the guitar and lyrics and it says you can find me where the music meets the ocean. And it says ZBB because it's the lyrics to their song. It's really pretty. I'm not going to show you. but <laughs> um, And so I was trying to get Zach to sign my tattoo. And he missed with the Sharpie because we were at Hershey Stadium. And he was on stage. And I was in the pit right up. I'm always in the pit by the stage. Um, and so I was going like this. And I was trying to get him to sign it. And he takes the Sharpie. And so he got my arm right there. <laughs> so I went and got it tattooed in. So that is Zach's signature on my arm. Yes, and my husband's like, somebody scratched on your arm. I'm like, first of all, it was Zach. And like, I was so excited. Like I couldn't, so that night, like I put like, I covered it up, like I couldn't sleep. And then I had to drive five hours back to Virginia to call my tattoo guy. And we inked it in and there's a little piece that's missing that should be attached and he wanted to fix it and I said no we're not fixing it because you just captured a moment in time that I can never get back so um, my son was at the concert with me it was his first time in the pit like it was just like an experience and so so yeah so that's my obsession <laughs> with Zach Brown band that I have his signature tattooed on my arm so that's what it is if you ever see it that's the only visible tattoo that I have when I'm wearing a short sleeve shirt. Everything else is covered. I, they're all personal. Everybody's got their thing. <laughs> Sorry. I just had to share that story with you guys. <laughs> so you'll know my obsession with them. Um, but this is our, our sugar skulls. So <laughs> that's it. So now I'm just going to clean up. I'm going to wash off my transfer. I will tell you, the big ones are a pain. You want a little tip? <laughs> See, it's just laughing. So when you wash these big ones, okay, um, take them in the shower, <laughs> put them in the shower or a bathtub or somewhere. Cause trying to do it in a little sink, you can do it in the sink, um, but they, they start to stick together. So the first time I had a really big transfer, I was trying to use it and it stuck together and I couldn't get it apart. I kept like pulling it and pulling it. So you run it under water. If you run it under water, you can get it apart easier. Just a tip for you guys. <laughs> so, I'm full of all kinds of information. <laughs> so, all right. Well, I kept you guys. So, we'll do another project in a little bit. How's that? Let me get this cleaned up because I want to go clean that transfer. Um, and I've got to figure out how to do something with this. Make something pretty. And then, um, the other one that I want to do today, just so you guys, if you want to keep an eye out for me if we come back on, I'm going to do this Beware. All right, so this is the beware board. I'm gonna do this probably, I don't know, in an hour or two, I gotta clean this up. And I'm gonna do it on this board. Can you see? So it's just a piece of wood, <laughs> like, and I painted it black. And so we're gonna do like a spooky Halloween board in just a little while, so. Keep notifications on. Thanks for tuning in, guys. All of you new people, it was nice meeting you. I hope I will see you guys again. A little bit this afternoon make sure that you follow my page and um, if you're not in my VIP group um, say hashtag VIP and I'll send you the link all right I'll see you in a little bit bye guys